it consists of tone, tone, semitone, tone, 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 semitone. Hi everyone, my name is Matthew Adama Bismatics. I want to welcome you to my new channel, Bismatics Online Bass and Music Lessons. So before we continue, if today is your first time visiting my channel, kindly subscribe. Click on the subscribe button and turn on the bell because a lot is going to be happening here. Yo guys, it's going to be another interesting one today. We're learning how to understand and play scales on the bass guitar. But we can't do that without first learning how to understand and play the major scale. So today's lesson is going to be all about how to play the major scale. Alright, let's go. The major scale, which is the atonic scale, it consists of seven notes, but if you add the octave, it becomes eight. That's do, re, mi, fa, so, la, ti, then do, the octave makes it eight. You may want to write this down. It consists of tone, tone, semitone, tone, 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 semitone. Tone, tone, semitone, tone, 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 semitone. That is to say from C. If you're on C and you want to play the diatonic scale, using that knowledge of tone, tone, semitone, tone, 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 semitone, you can play it on one straight line, which is do, tone, tone, right? From where you're standing, you're doing two tone. Tone, tone, semitone, tone, 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 semitone. So the root note is not included. From where you're standing, you move tone. Tone means um, adding two frets in front of you or backward. But in this case, we are going forward. So tone from C. You have D, which is where. Then we move another tone. We are doing tone, tone, semitone, tone, 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 semitone. So the second tone is now me. That's me. Now semitone because it's tone, tone, semitone. We've done first tone from the root tone, then tone. You now have the semitone, which is far. So it's tone, tone, semitone, tone, 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 semitone. Tone again. So tone again. La tone again. T, then semitone. Do, and I told you, here and here are the same. Do, re, mi, fa, so, la, ti, do, do, ti, la, so, fa, mi, re, do. But in music, you can't be going all the way down to achieve um, groove or rhythm. It will be too hectic. So. They've designed everything to be in one position for you. You can have this. So instead of going all the way down, you have it in one place. All right. And I'm going to take it really slow for you to get it. One very key thing I want to mention as we go on is fingering, using the right fingering. You know on the left and on the right there are ways to play the bass and then a way to place your finger. Of course you know the finger labeling. We have the index, we have the middle finger, we have the ring finger and we have the pinky All right, or baby finger. You can call it baby finger or pinky, the last one. And then we have the thumb. Now, on the left hand, the thumb is supposed to be placed this way, behind the fretboard. Alright, so if you do it this other way, you're wrong. It's going to affect so many things, your speed, your accuracy, your dexterity, your tone. But now, this is the way to place it. 
All right. On the right hand, there are different um, patterns according to what you want to achieve. If you are going to pick, this is the way to place your hand, your right hand. You place the thumb just like you're seeing right here. I mean, on the pickup, then you're using your index and your middle finger to strike. I know some people learn to just use their thumb to. That's the very wrong way. Although there are places for thumb, I'm going to teach you guys on that. But for the sake of the beginner's lesson, I want you to learn to use your index and your middle finger for now. Then you rest your thumb right here just like you're seeing all right then if you want to slap you're gonna do it this way just like you can see in the picture the way the thumb is placed on the strings all right that will give you a lot of balance to slap well and then there is another technique called muting technique so the fingering is different also this is the fingering all right, I just wanted to mention that because we're going to treat our slap techniques, muting techniques, tapping techniques as time goes on. But for the sake of this class, we are doing picking. So use this fingering for picking. All right, so let's go. So now as you can see, the fingering is what I want you to pay attention to at this point. You can see that I'm using my middle finger for DO, using pinky for RE, using index for ME, using the same middle finger for FA because they are on the same fret, DO and FA. FA is under DO. So then for SO. You can see that I'm using the same pinky because Re and so they are on the same fret. Now, after so, then La, La, this particular La we're using now is under Mi, which is the index we used. Now, after the La, then ring finger is going to work for the first time in this arrangement. So, use ring finger for T, then Do. Yeah, do will now be pinky because the same pinky that worked for re, it works for so, and it's working for the do because they are on the same fret. So the idea is place your finger like this. Four of them on the four, the, the first um, fret you are going to use. So each of them will take care of every note that is falling into each of those frets. Do you understand? Anything that concerns this particular fret, this finger will take care of. Anyone that concerns this other fret, this finger will take care of. There are exercises that will help you maintain this position. And I'm going to give you those exercises in our subsequent classes. But the sake of this class, you're just going to learn this pattern of do re mi fa sol la ti do. There are three different ways you can play them. And the tutorial for that will drop soon. All right, let's go. Everything you have here is the same as what you have here. What you have here is the same as what you have here. Like that. I hope you understand now. This is root notes, right? Tone, tone, semitone, tone, 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 semitone. stop here for today and 
And uh, if you enjoyed this lesson, kindly subscribe, drop a comment. If you have a question, ask your question. Uh, and if you want to sign up for a private class, we're available to take you one-on-one, -on -one, all right, from the beginner's level to advanced level. We love you, and I want to say see you again. More videos will be coming your way. Bye.